All right, so the first way to play the song is this way. Second way is to add the bass line. And then the third way is to play it without a capo. Everything's tuned to E flat to go. Which I really like this way actually. You could change the... Sorry. I really like both of them, um, but I'm going to show you this way first. So basically for the intro we got E minor. And then we've got G augmented slash D sharp. So these notes G, B, and D sharp create a G augmented chord. And this note is in the bass, one of the notes inside the chord. So it's a G slash augmented. All right. And then we have a G slash D, which we can play over here as part of this bar chord. We have these three notes and the D over here. Okay, um, which you can also play using the C shape for G, just putting D in the bass. All right, and then for the for the verse, we've got this chord progression. Da -na -na. pattern okay and then when you're going to the verse after the, the uh, when you're going to the chorus then you've got that one note just like a leading tone towards the C for the chorus okay because the chorus starts on C so you got this down and then you go to the C chord so then for the chorus we got So there I did the down So on the chorus repeat you do that D sharp augmented actually playing the third string You're just doing that okay for the bridge we've got two interesting chords leading up to the bridge it's just a little kind of riff thing so it's a G augmented which we can play like this or we could do it like this so that's a G augmented and a G sharp diminished seventh so B minor, E minor, and then A minor, D, intro, and then da -da -da -da. then it goes back into the verses. Okay, so that's it for the whole song. I'll now quickly show you exactly how to play it using the easier version. Okay, so 